Greetings and salutations, YouTube. It's Hadrian here. How's everyone doing today? Hope you guys are all doing super swell. We are here today at the Goodwill Marketplace and we're walking towards the computer store right now to see what they have today at the tech center. Let's go inside and check it out. It's connected to the regular Goodwill. So, oh, there it is, Goodwill Computer Works. There's the regular store right there. And this is the computer work store. Hey guys, just wanted to interrupt the video really quick to let you guys know that we are having a Memorial Day sale. So when you guys are seeing this between now and Monday, May 27, 2019, we're going to be having a sale in the shop. Go to itshadrian.com and message me um, in the shop. Send me a DM, let me know what you're interested in, and I will go ahead and lower the price for you by 20%. Uh, again, head to the shop. If you see anything that you like, message me. You get 20% off. All right, you guys, back to the video. We have um, this Adventure Time game that I want to see right there because the kids love Adventure Time. It's also a Yeti microphone over there I want to check out. All right, you guys, we are in the regular store. Look at this little dresser is 50 bucks. Pretty cute. They have those chairs. They have that table over there too. Very rustic. This is pretty cute. This is only 15 bucks. This is marble. It just needs to be screwed down a little bit tighter, but I'm going to get this. I'm gonna send this to the Philippines. This is pretty cute too. But I'm very excited about this little guy. Alright, now that I have my side table, let's go check out the rest of the store. I'm really excited. This is like a perfect side table for the condo in the Philippines. They have a bunch of incredible toys. DuckTales, Paw Patrol book, Wreck It Ralph. The side table is a little pricey, 40 bucks. Ooh, these like outdoor chairs are pretty nice. Okay, it says 25, but one of them has a sticker for 10 bucks. Hmm. This is actually a pretty nice side table. Nice black color. I'm trying to figure out the price on it though. Whoa, that's pretty epic too. This is pretty cool. I like the vintage vibe. That's our new. They have some faux leather chairs with like metal legs. Then they have these little stools. How much are these guys going for? These are $30 a piece. Look at this coffee table. 20 bucks. Hey, I saw the smaller one at another store, but here they have a set of three. Crate and barrel, five bucks. It's actually really pretty. Kind of like it. We might send that to the Philippines too. Ooh, maybe like, is this gonna be like a buying stuff for the Philippines thrifting vlog? Maybe. <laughs> I don't know, but I don't know. I'm finding some cute stuff in this store, you guys. Crate and barrel. This is a nice Target piece for only 15 bucks, originally 70, which is a pretty good deal. And there's no like damage to the top or anything, it's just a little loose, but that just means you need to screw down um, the top a little bit more. So that's cool. Let's see what other goodies we can find here.
Mega Martini. <laughs> Shopping is my cardio. I've been seeing this everywhere. I almost feel like I need that mug. So I'm now looking through the mugs and the glassware. Let's see if I can find anything cool. Oh, here's a Starbucks mug, $1.99. Oh, how cute is that? Okay, this is a maybe. I'm just gonna hold on to that for a second. You know, you gotta hold on to stuff even if you just think kind of like it. Because if you just leave it, it's probably gonna disappear. So, just carry it with you until the very end, make your last decisions. My snuggles are fierce. How cute is this little dog mug? Fringe, that's from Target. <laughs> Look at that. Knockout Fred. You see that yellow little table-y thing? It's really cute. I kind of want to get it. But it's like 15 bucks. Now I'm just looking through the plates on the in the other aisle. You guys know I already have a million plates, but you know. Always use a few more. You guys, this plate is so stinking cute. So cute. Ooh, flowers. Alright, so I came across some goodies. I found this DuckTales container thing. And I actually got Eliza all the little characters. And I also found a ton of, well, three really great handbags. found this fossil, this Marc Jacobs bag, which is perfect because these are the Gilmore Girls bags that I love. And these are made in Italy. And then this super cute Kate Spade. So, very excited. You guys. Look at this really cute Harry Potter box. Oh, I think it has like all the DVDs inside. Okay, wait, DVD interactive game. Oh, and it has all the movies. Oh my gosh, how fun. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to get this because this is gonna make even if I don't give it to the kids, my little cousin would love this too. She's like a huge Harry Potter fan. Five dollars. There's a little cat cookie jar. This one's missing the lid. Oh, this one's half off. Check it out, you guys. I just found this Bradley of London bag. It's not in too bad a shape either. Super cute. It's only 10 bucks, and I think that's half off because it's yellow. $5. Hey guys, we are back at the house. It's a couple of days later, and <clears throat> I'm a hot mess. But I'm really excited to share with you guys what I ended up getting from the Goodwill Marketplace. Now, that place is such an awesome store. If you guys are interested in going, again, it's in Santa Ana. Just type in Goodwill Marketplace, Santa Ana, California, and it should pop up. And it is home to three. Goodwill stores. They are separate, but like technically all connected into one building, but you have to like exit each one separately to go into the other one. Um, there's the Goodwill outlet, um, which is where everything is by the pound, the regular Goodwill store, and then the Goodwill computer work store where they sell technology such as computers, video games, sound systems, printers, televisions, you name it, electronically, they have it pretty much contained there. Uh, I think they just don't carry, like, kitchen appliances, but, yeah. Um, but I did go to their, that store first. Didn't really film inside, but let me show you guys what I ended up getting. I think I filmed a little bit, so. Um, the first thing I got was the Adventure Time game. Kids, the kids love Adventure Time, and they love their Nintendo Switch. So, whenever I find a game that I think they're gonna like, 
for the Nintendo Switch over there. I usually pick it up for them, but I know they're really going to like this because this is one of their favorite TV shows. Um, $14.99. I don't think it's a bad price for this. And I know they're really going to be very excited for it. So there's the first thing that I got. This next thing is actually for me, and I cannot wait to try it out. Um, and it is this Yeti microphone. It's the Yeti Blackout. Um, now I can do like voiceovers, I guess. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> I, I got it. I'm pretty excited about it. Um, I wish that I could actually attach this to my camera, which I think I can, but um, not like very portable. So still going to look for a portable option, but this one is really, really great just to have um, like at the house to use so very excited um this one was 70 dollars. i think they retail for over 100 and this one is brand new the box was just broken so that's why i ended up there so i'm very thankful and excited to have found this guy so now i can um do voiceovers i guess um so very happy so those are the first two things that I got. Oh, and I gotta save my receipt just in case the microphone actually doesn't work, even though it is new. Um, if you buy anything like electronic from that store, um, you can exchange. You can actually return for cash, which is, I guess it's not like great for everyone. I know that if I return it, um, I can definitely still use it because I'm always at the thrift stores anyway, but you can return it. You just can't get cash back. You just get a gift card back. Um, so yeah, but there's that. Then uh, I went into the Goodwill regular store that was right next door. And the first thing I have here is this little um, Louie from DuckTales stuffed animal. Eliza especially is obsessed with DuckTales right now. And I have just been picking up anything DuckTales for him. So very excited to get this guy. It was only $1.99. Uh, yeah. I just need to find um, the other two. Huey, Dewey, I think. Huey, Dewey, and Louie are the three. And he was sitting inside this super duper cute Starbucks mug. I have just a weakness for Starbucks mugs. I don't know what it is. But this one is so cute. It's like black and white. And then it has the mint to green handle, but what killed me is how cute these guys are. They're like, I don't know if they're like little bears, they kind of like remind me of little meerkats just like popping out, but I think meerkats have different ears, so probably bears. And these were a dollar, this was a dollar and 99 cents. There we go. Um, the next thing I have here, oh, <coughs> this is right here. I don't know how well it'll fit in frame, but I did end up getting this side table, which is really nice. It has, um, it's wood. I don't know what kind of wood, but it kind of looks like mango. Um, and then the top is marble. And it was only $15, which is crazy. It's called the Lanham Accent Table. It was originally 70 bucks, so for $15, I think this is such a good deal. And this one was really great because it wasn't like damaged in any way. Usually sometimes the tops are like damaged somehow and this one is still in fantastic condition. So I am very, very excited to um, have gotten that guy. The next thing I have here, I actually have in this bag, which I still need to open up, but I did get a beautiful um, vase piece. This guy, so gorgeous. I love like the texture on it and this is actually a crate and barrel piece so um, it's called the rope face made in Portugal crate and barrel this guy was only four dollars and ninety nine cents and it's so beautiful I really really like it um, I don't know if I'm going to keep this here or if I'm going to be sending it to the Philippines but it's gorgeous I love the color on it and very very excited to have found this face at the Goodwill next thing I have here now this one is gonna be for the kids uh, I don't know if I'll use them from, I'll, I'll give it to my nephews or if I'll give it to my little, uh, my little cousin. But I found this super, super cute Harry Potter chest, which is so adorable. Like it has a little fake handle, the little hinges, it opens like this. And bam! So I opened it up not thinking that anything would even really be inside. Um, but it comes with the Harry Potter game interactive dvd game 
Hogwarts challenge. And to top it off, it also comes with all of the DVDs as well. So year three, a bonus DVD, year two, and year five. So it doesn't come with all of them. Yeah, Order of the Phoenix. It doesn't come with all of them, but I just thought it was really cute anyway. And they have most of the DV I think, um, they have most of the DVD sets anyway. So that's totally cool. But I thought the box was really cute. And the game is going to be really fun. I actually think I might just give it to um, my little cousin. Because I think she would really enjoy this. So really, really cute. This was only $4.99. There's that. <clears throat> what do we have up next? Oh my gosh! Okay. There's this one. So remember, um, I found this. And it was, um, this one was $9.99. It was yellow, but it was missing the top. Um, and then I found another one that, um, they had like a couple more that were not yellow, so they weren't half off. Um, so they were still $10. But I found another one that was yellow and half off so I was very excited and it had the top on it so this is just a really super cute like cookie jar and it's a cactus has like a gold flower on top I thought it was so cute it's from um it's Opal House uh Target by art it's an Opal House Target piece so really really excited it's a cookie jar but I'm just gonna use it decoratively probably so adorable I love it so much I almost forgot that I even got that uh next I have some handbags to share with you guys and first up I have this beautiful fossil crossbody bag I love it it's like an embossed lizard print and then it has um, contrasting dark brown um, pebbled leather uh, crossbody strap um, but this is only seven dollars and ninety nine cents and yeah really really cute still has the little charm on it and everything and it's in really fantastic condition so I am very 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 excited for this and next thing um, I found this just sitting like in the corner but I'm very excited that I found it this is a Radley of London um, like little shoulder bag so stinking cute is in a beautiful smooth brown leather interior has the cute little Scotty dogs on it and this one was $10 but again yellow so half off so only five bucks what a deal this is so stinking gorgeous okay then I think this is the last last item I have to share with you guys <clears throat> and I love this bag so much whenever I find it I get really really excited and I got really excited when I found this. I've actually found this bag probably like five times. But this, this is Marc Jacobs. I call these um, the Gilmore Girls bags because Lorelai had these bags. And this one specifically on the show. Um, if you guys are diehard Gilmore Girls, Girls fans like uh, my sister, my mother, and I, then you'll be very familiar with these Marc Jacobs bags. They're so cute. These are actually Marc Jacobs collections. So these are made... In Italy, this bag, I uh, believe, retails for over $1,000 or close to. And it's beautiful black hardware. has a contrasting stitching. It has a two pockets. And then it has um, two zipper compartments and then a middle compartment. This one has some pen marks in the bottom as well as some pennies and bobby pins. But that'll be easy to clean out. Other than the pen marks. Pen marks are, like, horrible. Especially the interior is suede will come out but it's not like it's not very obvious in there anyway but beautiful 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 bag and this one was $13 and that rounds out today's video thank you guys so much for hanging out with me today checking out all this stuff again the Goodwill Marketplace is so cool in Santa Ana they have a couple um <clears throat> at least in Southern California I know, they, I know they have other computer work stores and Goodwill Outlets. So go check it out. And the outlet is usually attached to a regular store as well that you can visit or there's another one nearby. Uh, and if you guys haven't gone to those, I suggest going. They're so much fun. Uh, you just can't film inside the Goodwill marketplaces normally or the Goodwill Outlets. So 
don't normally do it. Uh, but it's a fun experience. Clothing by the pound. They have housewares as well and books um, and shoes. So um, go check it out. I love you guys so much. Let me know down below in the comments if you guys have ever been to the Goodwill Marketplace. Uh, and if you guys ever see me, say hi. I saw a couple of you guys when I was thrifting this past weekend, which was so cool. Uh, I've never met so many of you guys at once. So like the thrift squad is going strong. I love you guys so much. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Giant elephant picture. Oh, I think this is for like taking pictures. It's like almost like a camera thing. And it's kind of like standing on the floor. And then it like balances the camera.